Connell, hope I spelled that right. Connell Manor speaks on his social media presence. So his social media present. Listen, he was on the, the podcast from the hill. Shout out to them. Um, Alabama AM podcast. They got on YouTube. Y'all can go over there and follow them. Um, you know me, I don't take credit from nobody. Uh, I got this clip from LaShonda um from Twitter, but this is from the From the Hill podcast on YouTube. And and he speaks on it. Look at these AM Bamas, they all with the eyes. It's not about me. It's not about you. It's about the team. Everything I do is for the team. Okay. So, uh, you know, I don't never want it to be about me. And, you know, I, I want it to be about A&M football program. And so uh, that's why you don't see me on all that stuff. And, and I, you know, it's just, but if that's what the people want. I, I, I get on there a little bit and, uh, Hum hum with them and give them a little bit of what they want, whether you like it or not. She best let them know. Best hey, this know. this is what Demetrius Ooh. says she wants you to do with Twitter, coach. That was she wants you. You got to be active and talk trash. <laughs> <laughs> well, brother, now you know, Miss Glenn, good to start some mess now. Now you know, you know, Miss Glenn, she good to start some mess now. She gonna now, Miss Glenn gonna start some mess. Even talk trash. <laughs> <laughs> well, trust me, trust me. A, a lot of people like it when I do that. I have trustees telling me to do what I do, and uh, they got my back. Just do what I do, and so right, right. I, it ain't no shame in my game. I'm gonna, I'm gonna do what I do. I like to have fun, and it's never nothing personal against anybody. Like now, let me say this, and I'm gonna keep it a buck with you. He lying. <laughs> See. The one thing about me is I got to call a spade a spade. I'm going to call a spade a spade. If this was Dion, I would say the same thing about him. So I, I got to keep I got to keep the energy the same. Connell Manor is a damn liar. You're lying, bro. Like, what do you mean it's not about you? What do you? So was it not about you when you called Dion out about his ankle injury? Was it not about you when you were taking shots about Dion? Like, I need to know. I need to know because you can't have it both ways. Oh, I'm not on social media because it's not about me. But when you was talking trash, it makes it about you. It makes it about you because your team has to back up the shit you talking. So that's a lie. You lying. You're not on social media because you're lazy. It goes back to the point where I say all the coaches in the SWAC are lazy. They are lazy. They Coach Willie Simmons is the only one that is out here talking his talk all the time, social media, on FAMU, doing radio, all that type of stuff, right? Connell Maynard is just now coming out and doing stuff. Just now. He's lying. This is a lie. Because when Dion shut you up with the 50 piece, you never came back and said nothing else. You ain't say nothing else after that. And then when you went down for the Mobile Classic, oh, me and Dion are the best of friends. You ain't talk that shit then. So it's either one or two ways. You going to always be who you are, which is talk mess, or you only going to talk mess when you in a high position. But at the end of the day, anytime you talk mess, it is about you because you're the one talking mess. You're the one talking mess. So that's a lie to be like, oh, 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 my God. I, I don't I don't. I took my team all the time. It's not about me. It's about the team. It's about the A&M. Brand. You're lying. You're a liar. It's not about me. It's not about you. It's about the team. Did you think about that? When you was talking trash. The thing I do is for the team. Oh, Dion, can I get one of them scooters? Can I borrow one of them scooters? What, were you thinking about the team then? See what I'm saying? You can't have it both ways. Now, once again, I don't have a problem with you talking mess. I really don't. I would prefer all these coaches to talk mess. I think it's great. But don't thank, thank you. Thank you. Thank you. Thank you. Don't throw the rock and be like, oh, I told my team all the time. It's not about it's not about me. It's not about you. It's about the team. Ninja, you're lying. You're lying. 
you're lying. Because then on the second end of that, oh, you know, oh, oh, I like, I, you know, I do what I do. Uh, what? The whole statement is a contradiction. Get more, get more five stars. But it's not about me, right? It's about the team. It's, it's, see, it's that. It's that for me, right? Oh, I'm not on social media. Oh, I'm not on social media because I tell my team all the time. It's not about me. It's not about me. It's about, it's about my team. No, you're lazy. You're lazy. Wait. But my issue with this statement is I tell my team all the time. It's not about. It's, it's not about. It's not about. It's not about I. It's about the team. You didn't think about the team when you were making statements out in public about Dion, and didn't think his team was going to back that up. And your team had to back that up. You see what I'm saying? So you emotional A&M fans, y'all can say whatever you want. First of all, you barely go to any games anyway. You, I, I don't even know how you got a football podcast. You Bama's barely go to games anyway. Homecoming and the classic. That's it. You, you don't cheer. You don't jeer. Your band sits there and watch the game like they a spectator. So I don't know what y'all Bama's even talking about football anyway. If I'm being honest, if I'm being a whole buck, if you want to keep it a buck out here in these streets, you go to two games out the year, okay? Miss me with that. So, oh, oh, yeah, how about that? How about you tell your fans, how about you take shots at your fans and tell them to come out and absolutely support and cheer and jeer? How about that? How about have some energy for a freaking football game? How about that? Okay? How about that? So, since we want to talk, since we, since we talking, since we, since we talking, you, you know what? How about this? You guys care about football so much. What time that spring game start? But you want football school, though. But y'all care about football. No swag team that cares about football is going to put their spring game at 10 o'clock in the morning. Ain't no real swag football team that their team cares about football, that their school cares about football, is going to put their spring game at 10 o'clock in the morning. But y'all care about football, though. All right. Okay. I'm just, I'm just saying. That, 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 that ain't adding up to me. That ain't adding up. Oh, okay, guys. You know what we're going to do? We're going to get together, and we're going to put this spring game at 10 o'clock in the morning. Guess who probably made that decision to put the game at 10 o'clock in the morning? The same guy who was probably talking about, oh, my God, I care about the team more than myself. It's not really about I. You know, it's not. It's really not about me. It's about the team. It's really not about the fans that don't show up. <laughs> it's about my 10 o'clock in the morning spring game. <laughs> Who wants to come to that? Miss me with it. You know, and you know your fans don't because they don't care about being there at 10 o'clock in the morning anyway because they ain't going to show up anyway. I was at the spring game last year. Can most of these Alabama a &M fans say they were? No. Because I was there. I was at the game last year at 10 o'clock in the morning with crust in my eye with no band, no music, no food, no excitement. Miss me with it. So once again, like I said, the Bama's lying.